Rihanna performed solo and ran through hits like Diamonds and Umbrella. Kansas City is due to receive the second half kickoff, its first possession after Patrick Mahomes limped off the field in the second quarter. Doing two songs that feature Jay-Z back-to-back and not bringing out HOV definitely surprised me. So many of the previous Super Bowl performances have had multiple acts. Very striking to do the whole set solo. Well, that was that. No guests, no new songs, just Rihanna featuring Rihanna, in all her resplendence. Rihanna is now ascending back to the heavens, from which she came, and belting out her power ballad Diamonds. We know Jay-Z is in the building, will she bring him out for Umbrella? Now she's performing All of the Lights, a track from the controversial Kanye West. Not terribly surprised she didn't bring him out. A quick break to reapply some Fenty powder, of course. As expected, this performance is basically just one giant medley of hits. A little bit of Root Boy, a little bit of work, and now she's treating us to some of her collaboration with DJ Khaled, Wild Thoughts. Rihanna is just blazing through her hits, only girl, in the world, transitions right into an exuberant we found love. After some excellent mugging for the camera, she's taking us to the club with Where Have You Been? Rihanna is here, radiant in red. And she's opening with a bleeped version of Bitch Better Have My Money. Did not see that one coming. That song was in the top 5 on betting markets, but far below Don't Stop the Music and Run This Town. All over the internet this week, fans have been speculating about which song Rihanna will perform first. Don't Stop the Music is by far the favorite on betting markets, followed by Stay in Diamonds. But hey, I could also see it being one of the long shots, umbrella or work, perhaps? At long last. It's Rihanna time. Kansas City is down 10 points and Patrick Mahomes appears to have re-injured his ankle. If he cannot be effective, look for backup Chad Henney. He came in after Mahomes originally hurt his ankle against Jacksonville and went 5 of 7 for 23 yards, leading Kansas City on a 98-yard touchdown drive. The final two minutes of the first half unspooled in miserable fashion for Kansas City.